Hey, what's up, everyone? So we're gonna do a Sylvie versus Allies, and I'm Sylvie this time. Construction complete. Building. New construction options. So I'm in the bottom right. This is Lake Blitzen. Construction and complete. This is actually a player that's a, a hard to beat player. He's capable Building. of beating me, and he actually you beat me. Ready. Um. I think the New same day that this video options. I did. So complete. I'm just gonna scout Unit him. Ready. And what he does is he's like a high pressure player. Like if you ever notice a lot of games how Soviet ready. rushes allies and uh and uh, um Engineering. basically the Soviet crushes some of the allies sometimes. But this is like a guy who like throws a lot of air at you, tries to like mix New it up with um options. to try to counter that. So if he kills you, he's gonna kill you early. So this is a guy who almost kind of like. Units you might ready. actually have to take the defense of a Soviet to win, because he's gonna he's gonna spend all his money in air. He might even sell his MCV. That's the kind of style. He's kind of like an all-in player. If you can see like um two ore pad two ore patch all in complete. or something like that. Building. You know, that's not a terminology that Red Two uses, options. but we're gonna Unit do it for this lost. game. Building. Yeah, he's gonna. He might um like move his. MCV to the gems and then just sell it and go all in. So as you see, I'm scouting and he's moving his Unit MCV ready. to the gems already. Before he even gets uh, right after his war factor, then he's probably gonna make a helicopter to get um New round get, uh, oh, um, islands. But I don't see the helicopter Unit yet. Ready. I'm actually not even sure if he got the islands. Well, so uh, we'll find out in a minute. Unit ready. So I'm just going. I'm just going straight tanks, trying to maybe try to rush him. Because I figure if he's gonna go for islands, for helicopter, and or a navy port, I'm just gonna rush him and try to kill him right off the bat. Unit ready. And maybe if I can't kill him right here, I'm gonna weaken him. Maybe make some of his miners slow some of his economy down. If I can make his miners, you know, beam back and forth, that slows him down because they don't get a full scoop. You know, actually, he tried. I don't know if he tried to steal my oil right there. It looked like he did, and it looked like my sentry gun just killed him right there. But I didn't see the actual engineer, I just see the IFV, so what else could it be? So it looks like I'm winning this tank battle, but not by much. What he's trying to do right now is mix up the tanks, try to cycle them through, and he actually did like a not bad job right there. He's trying to cycle the tanks, so, um, so basically when I'm tank fighting him, I don't hit the same tank more than, more than once or more than too many times. So I'm just going to get my second R. So you want to keep. So basically, it's better to have a bunch of tanks in the red than than have than have a bunch of tanks that are um that are basically basically you're gonna have more tanks at That's my concentration. Okay, so he, now he's coming for um rocketeer. It's better for more tanks to take the hit than um than, than fewer and like for them to die. You know what I mean? Because then you can heal them and then you can have more. DPS damage, damage per second and small all unit. So and I remember the last time I played this guy, <coughs> I actually made one flag truck and I lost the game. And he made much more air than I expected. And and, and another time, I think I don't know if it was him or another time or a different player. I only made one flag truck and I lost two like I just a swarm record here, so I'm so I'm figured I'm just gonna make um two flag trucks and eventually make a flag cannon. Unit Instead of ready. trying to save all my energy and put it into tanks and not take him, remember this is an all-in player. Like he's just gonna, he's gonna throw everything he has at me. So I make a sentry gun. He actually put me right now. I got put in the defensive. So I'm gonna make sure he doesn't kill the flag. Try to get that flag truck out there. I actually did. Try to um defend him. He has a rocket too, but he's trying to hit me from the left and the right at the same time. He has para drops coming down, so it looks like, it, like you know I'm in hot water right now. And I'm basically under defensive, so I want to repair the sentry gun, get my electric back up, and then get my flag truck. I mean, my flag cannon start starting to build, and I want to try to get into water at the same time and try to steal one of the islands. Try to get one of my islands. I'm going to get the pair drop with the oil, but the pair drop, the airport and the island is close, so I'm going to go for that. So, and then he actually, ooh, he actually took out that flag truck, which isn't good for me, so I'm going to hide this flag cannon behind the war factory. And he has a lot of dogs and GIs, all he has to do is bring the dogs and GIs and if this was Yuri's revenge right now, it'd be actually GIs would be more difficult to deal with. By the way, which is just a red alert too. So my dogs basically <laughs> screwed up those GIs were pretty bad, so looks like I got a little bit more worth of tanks in them. So one he's going for he's gonna go for my I'm gonna try to tank smash him right here. Have a tank battle and get the island at the same time. Because he had, he was slightly distracted by trying to kill my um, engineer there, and I actually got mad right here. I was like, "What the hell?" 
but um, he, because I, I said NGE, but it really wasn't an NGE. It was just a shooting it with a rocketeer, but I don't even know if he got the island or not, to tell you the truth. So it looks like he's gonna actually catch me sleeping for a minute. And I wanna save that one rhino tank. And I wanna target the, um, target the tanks, not the dogs. But he's cycling through. See how he's cycling through? That's like kind of like something like if you ask Marsh or someone, they're gonna tell you that's what you do against Soviet, which is what he's doing. So he's doing a not bad job right now. And I don't think he sees the flag. Unit ready. He, well, I don't have a flag can yet. I'm about to put. I'm about to put it behind the factory. So I don't think he's gonna see it though. Oh yeah, he's there. It is. Oh, actually, I already had it. He didn't see it. I remember I had one stealth, it's like a stealth You could actually see it, but you can only see like a little bit of it, so I'm gonna lose this um, power plant. I tried to save it with a dog and a, and a miner, but it was too late. Now, this is tank fighting him still. I wanna get my electric back up. Maybe go for the island. But actually, actually, it might, might be a little bit of a risk, so I wanna. Building. Almost, I might hit zero right here on the money. Close to it, but I probably ready. won't. So I'm gonna cancel this flag cannon in the middle if I have to, just to keep my um, tank production going. He actually he looks like he sold his MCV. He said, "What well, did I? He he killed the engineer in the raft, but so I'm gonna Castle. make and then build it right back. And I have the second flag cannon in case he so he doesn't kill my um refinery near the ore again. I mean near the gems again." Complete. And I'm actually was like terrified of um, destroyers coming out and killing that. But he looks like he didn't make a, na make a navy, so I pushed right near the shore. I was like, whatever. I remember this is a this is a hard to beat player. So I noticed how the style's different in other allies. Where if I play allies, I'm more of a defensive style, and he's more of an aggressive. You know, all in. You know, just kill him right away. You throw throw air, mix it up, type of player. I'd be good if I had a desolate right now, but I don't. So I'm gonna. This is gonna be a good tank fight right here, and it looks like I'm winning, and because of my planner tank range is a little better, so I started. I think I pumped out a couple of conscripts right there just to absorb a couple of hits, and he's actually actually losing pretty bad right now, and he's got two tanks versus five, and I'm pumping out more, and I gotta think. So he's just gonna. He's a good game. He just gave up right there. That's the end of it.